it me, Tree. Hi. It has been a minute, a minute or five since I vlogged. January? January was... January was a year. So we're going to go with that. It, it literally... I saw somebody say, say January has lasted three years and I have... I, I, I felt that at a cellular level. But things are coming. It's like Black Panther is coming, which is really exciting. There is an opening at the art garage tomorrow where I will have new work because that's what you do. In the, the last month, and a week? I don't know. I don't know when I, I last did the thing. If I looked at my records, I could because I have all the video. I just haven't edited it yet. Gnome and I have put out a podcast. It is called Conversations from the North Woods, where nerd verses meet existential angst. So we're, we're going to be coming up on episode three, though it's actually episode four. We have an episode zero because we're, we're nerds. Gnome and I have played our first game of D&D in an Ice Age a couple weeks ago. No, yeah. Last week? Last Sunday? I, it's It was recent. It was relatively recent. Our DM is out of town for like a month. So this was our one shot to figure out if we liked how she ran the thing and if we could all play together and it was definitely successful and we all survived more or less intact and didn't get eaten by a neutral evil thing that wanted to make a bargain so and let me tell you I am playing a circle spores druid and this is like the funniest thing ever because I, my character basically is like let me bring you mushroom joy. <laughs> so yeah, we're having a good time with that. I have gotten new art supplies. I've gotten some acrylic wash. I got some water soluble oils because I've always wanted to try oil painting, but it's like all the linseed oil and solvents and stuff like that kind of freaked me out, especially since they can combust. So this can still do all of those things like combust but is a little less likely to do so. Maybe, probably not. I'm doing some rearranging of what my tables are going to look like at cons to accommodate for the fact that I now have the, the beautiful printer that I have now officially done prints off of the, for the show, that show thing. Thing I do at the art garage, my, the, my new quarter stuff was all printed off of my, my new beautiful printer, so I, I have submitted an art residency, not re art residency, I've submitted a, I have submitted a artist retreat application, which once I know if I've gotten accepted or rejected, I will tell you more about. I think the likelihood is rejection, but there's always hope. A and I am uh, doing an application for an artist in residency thing in Green Bay for like elementary schools so that art so that kids get to have one-on-one -on -one interaction with professional artists. So I need to finish doing that, which is exciting. And right now I'm taking a very 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 low key painting class with a friend of mine teaching it. It's not like college credit or anything, it's through the art garage, so it's a community arts thing, but I've been feeling like I needed a, um, I've been feeling stagnant. Go figure, that happens to all of us. Been feeling stagnant, but also was feeling like I needed a refresher course in painting, at least like, you know, some kind of painting, because I haven't painted in a while. And somehow or another, I managed to get through art school without actually having to take a painting class. So, yeah, it's like I did the same thing with printmaking. I managed to, like, just steer clear of that thing. Yeah. What can I say? I, I, I was so thoroughly determined in sculpture and mixed media that they were just like, Yeah, go, go, go. And just let me run. So yes, these are the things I've been doing. This is the stuff that has been taking up most of my time. The artist retreat application 
particularly because it was literally a month of me trying to answer like 18 questions and most of them were not difficult questions to answer but for some reason i was having an executive dysfunction issue with the entire thing so it took a <laughs> really long amount of time like literally i turned it in the 30th it was due the 31st so we're doing good Oh, I also, like, have updated my website. I don't have the shop stuff updated yet, but my website actually looks like maybe I might actually be a professional. Go figure. I'm so proud of myself. All right, I, I, I have to, like, go do things and go be a person who makes things and edit the last, like, three weeks of freaking vlog video stuff. So, and do that application. So, yeah. Do good, be kind, be brave, courage. Don't knock on your desk while you're doing the thing.